Hello and welcome back to the studio. Today we are going to continue our single leaf table kit and we're going to be installing our slides, our locks, and our leaf leveler. So let's get right into it. So on our last video, we, uh, we put our tops together, we laid out uh, all of our our skirting and our legs and all of that we figured out you know where we wanted all of that we put our uh, our skirt brackets in here our support brackets now it's time to go ahead and put our slides on here and let me talk to you a little bit about the slides if you can see that we've got a, a red and a blue that's just a left and a right technically um, they do need to be in a, a set but but there's no difference whether I do this or do this okay so don't get don't get freaked out about that you do need a left and a right so the first thing I've done here is kind of kept in mind all that I need and want to do in this table these locks would normally go on the outside edge okay so like you know right out here between the skirting and the the outside of the the table this table is only 30 inches wide and so because of that you have a little bit less distance here on the outside. I'm going to go ahead and just use these locks in the very center, okay? So let's just put those there for, for reference right now. Also, on these, uh, these tabs here, we need to be able to put kind of a left and a right on those so that they're going to kind of cross over each other like this when you close that table. So I need enough space to do those. Having thought all that through, I decided to come six inches in from the inside of my skirting to the outside of my slide. And I've made just a couple little marks here. I'm actually gonna take just a, a scrap piece of Luan that I've cut and drop down in there. And I'll use that to push this up against just to make sure that these are perfectly parallel so on these this is completely together okay and what I'm actually going to do is just spread that ever so slightly I would say like a good eighth maybe maybe even a quarter and here again the reason I'm doing that if these tops were to shrink just slightly this would still be able to close completely if that makes sense okay so that's my thinking there now I've made a, a center mark right here. Okay, this is a 26 inch slide. So at 13 inches, I've made a, a little mark and I'm actually going to line that mark up with the, the joint right there. Let's get these out of the way. Okay, inch and three quarter screws work really well with a one inch top. But let me, let me show you this. You need to be, <laughs> please think about this before you put screws into these uh slides you have to figure out the the thickness of your top maybe you only have a three quarter inch top in which case you want to use a shorter screw okay so please think all that through <laughs> figure all that out before you uh run the screw through the top i'm gonna just get that centered on my mark just sit that down in that pre-drilled hole and snug it up and this slide will actually accommodate two leaves. Two 12 inch leaves would easily fit in this space. So now that we've got our, our slides completely installed, uh, we slipped our, our leaf into there and you wouldn't have to have it in there. We will have to have it for our, our locks. So I thought, well, let's put it in there and, uh, and we'll have it in place for the leaf levelers also. So the idea is to have them kind of cross like this, okay? And all they do is just hold that leaf up off of the slides and make sure that they are in line with the pins as you, you know, begin to close that table. This is a two inch piece. I made a, a tiny little pen line. So we line these up and Tap that in to get it set. One little screw to hold it. So the next step is our locks. And like I said, now normally you would have these out on the outside uh, between the, the outside edge of the skirting. We're just gonna put them right here in the middle. As you come in, it turns the piece 
okay, in, into place. And then as you continue to turn, it pulls it in and locks and reverse like so. There are real little lines right here. That's going to be the joint, okay, uh, between the two pieces. Likewise, this edge right here would be even with that joint. The reason being, when you take this leaf out of here, this and this are actually going to be coming together. With the leaf in there, you'll have that. Yeah, we need a pretty good straight line there for a center. So, let's test these out. Okay, so here we are, we've finished our table and uh, I just wanna show you, you know, basic functions here. And remember, this is big enough that you could put two leaves in it, right? Uh, so you're just gonna take your leaf and line that up. And like so, and then your locks underneath. Let's do that. And there you go, you're ready to go. Hopefully, uh, you like the, the build. Everything that we did here is a full kit, okay? So uh, click on the link below and, and it would give you everything that you see here. Hopefully, uh, you understand better all of the components and what they're for and how to uh, you know, assemble everything once you get it. If you would, like and uh, subscribe if you haven't already and share this video with some others that might be interested in it. And uh, we'll see you next time on Builder Studio.